What a world, huh guys? What a world we live in. We have so many options for streaming media devices nowadays. Boxes, sticks, built into the TV. Here's a tip for you. Roku's the best. Why do I like Roku so much? Because it can play just about anything. Just about. So today I'm going to show you how to play the stuff you can't really play in it. Your own stuff. We are going to learn how to use Roku's screen mirroring feature. For this, you will need a newish Roku box, stick, or TV. I'm doing this with a 2015 era Roku stick. They're cheap. A newish Windows 8 or Windows 10 PC. I'm doing this with a 2015 era Asus ZenBook with a relatively low powered processor while video recording its screen, and it still works. And you'll need about a minute. This is easy as falling in love. Now this also works with Windows and Android mobile devices. Android via the screen mirroring setting and Windows via the project my screen setting. So dig around a bit if you're interested in doing this from your phone or tablet. Okay, here we go. From Roku, we're going to go into the settings menu. Then we're going to go all the way down to the system option. Then we're going to check to make sure that enable screen mirroring is selected. So hint, if you're lazy, you could probably skip this step because it's probably enabled. Then from our computer, we'll ask Cortana about Project to get the Project a Second Screen option. This can also be found by going to Settings, System, and clicking Connect to a Wireless Display. I'm going to choose Duplicate because I want to mirror what's on my screen, and then I'm going to wait for my Roku stick to pop up in the menu. Obviously, you'll want both your computer and the Roku stick on the same Wi-Fi network. That should be a given. Click on that, and then back on our TV, with a quick whiff of ozone, we see our laptop screen loading up. Now I can do things like head into my TechCrunch folder and load up an old classic. Notice how smooth the video is. Remember, this is on a relatively underpowered laptop that's also using screen capture software at the same time. There comes a time in every man's life when he, you know, he just needs to run away from home for a while. Maybe not forever, maybe not for years, maybe just until he drinks six beers alone in a shed out in the backyard. We can also do things like look at family photos with a group of our friends or plan a trip to Costa Rica over Christmas together with our friends. And once the fun's over, just click the home button on the Roku remote to disconnect the computer. That's it. See? Easy as falling in love. I probably could have just gone directly to TechCrunch and watched the videos that way. But we learned something. And if you want to make your own TechCrunch videos and watch them via Roku, this might be, might be the only way you can do it. Unless, you know, let me know, I'll put in a good word for you. I'm going to take my job. <laughs> good luck. <laughs> I'm going to come at you like a tornado made of arms, teeth, and fingernails if you try to take my job. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you real bad.